It takes a lot of time to record your script in your own voice, setting up the voice recorders and then do the noise cancellation or removal from that recording. We can get rid of all that hassle with ClipChamp text-to-speech AI feature. Let's see step-by-step step how we can use the text-to-speech feature and add voiceover in our videos. Before we go ahead, subscribe to our channel, so you don't miss out any video we publish in future. You can appreciate our work by hitting the like button. It definitely motivates us a lot. Step 1. Select text-to-speech option. On the left sidebar, click on the record and create tab. Click on the text-to-speech button. Step 2. Pick a language, voice, and speed. Write your text in the text box, and then choose from a wide range of languages, including Spanish, Italian, Japanese, Korean, Greek, Hindi and more. Select a voice from various styles, ages, pitches, accents and natural tones. The speed slider can also help you set the right speed for your video narration. Select between slow, regular, and fast speech speeds. Step 3. Preview and save. Click on the preview play button to listen to your voiceover preview. A voiceover is a production technique that lets creators narrate a story without coming in front of camera. A voiceover usually features your own voice reading a script, then edited onto videos like gaming, training, and virtual learning videos. If you don't like the preview you can fine-tune the voice and speed setting till you are happy with the results. Here are a few tips for your voiceover scripts. Use punctuation to make impactful speed changes to your text-to-speech voiceover. Add full stops in your script to add a moderate pause to your text-to-speech. Commas add a short pause to your text-to-speech. Question marks change the intonation of your voiceover. Once you are happy with the preview, click on Save to Media to return to the video editor. Your voiceover will appear in the Your Media tab. Step 4. Use saved voiceover in the video. Now, just drag and drop the AI-generated voiceover onto the timeline. For the sake of example, we'll get one stock video on our timeline. And now you can perform regular operations like cut, move, duplicate voice clip just the way you do it with your regular voiceover and sounds. Remember that it's not at all necessary to create a long voiceover with your complete script in one go. You can always write small portions of our script and create multiple small voice clips so it become easy for you to move them over timeline and sync with video. Now once your editing is complete, you can export the video. Just click on export button, choose the video quality you like and ClipChamp will save the video on your computer. That's how easy it is now to create amazing human-like voiceovers, without spending huge money and a lot of time.